We didn't expect to come here, but the view of Amicalola Falls at the end was more than worth the journey. You see, at Amicalola Falls you have fresh air, space, and of course a lot of amazing views. But the views are only part of what makes the waterfall as amazing as it is. So at the end when I show you what took us so long to get to, let me know down in the comments if it would be worth your time to hike up to this waterfall. The word Amicalola is a Cherokee word, and it means tumbling waters, which is very much appropriate for the size of the waterfalls. Now I actually undersold this place in our adventure video. It's not 607 feet, it's actually 729 feet from top to bottom, and is indeed the largest waterfall in the southeast United States. These falls were not well known by the European Americans until about 1832, which is the same year the Cherokee had signed the Treaty of New Dakota, also known as the Trail of Tears. And the first written account of the falls was by William Williamson, when he wanted to claim the land of the 6th Georgia Land Lottery in 1833. Williamson was so taken aback by the falls that he was even quoted as saying, perhaps the most majestic scene that I had ever witnessed. Too bad for him, he never received the land and it was won by an unknown settler. Now I know this is one of our shorter videos, but before we get to the end, I would just like to say thank you so much to all who have watched, continue to watch, and have subscribed. It is amazing seeing and hearing all of the feedback. And if you haven't subscribed yet, consider doing so. It means a lot to both myself and Connor, and it would also ensure that you don't miss out on any future adventures. So you may have noticed in our previous video there was actually a road that allows you to drive all the way to the top of the falls just in case you are in some way physically unable to make the trek of the thousand steps. For those that are capable, I would definitely suggest that you take that trek, that you make that journey, you walk up those thousand steps, and you enjoy what you worked for. An adventure is not about the beginning or the end, it's about everything in between. There's actually not much to say about this place other than what I've already stated. So I'll just let the views speak for themselves. Oh boy.